Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I'm going to show you another way that I use to find ponds that uh, I haven't fished before. I use the nav in my car. Uh, I know you can use Google Maps, but sometimes I don't have time to do it ahead of time or just on a whim. I take a different route, get redirected from traffic, whatever. So I'll turn the nav on in my car, drive safely of course, and see if you can find um, ponds hopefully that uh, they'll let you fish it doesn't say no fishing with the sign so I figured it'd be a good opportunity to show you guys uh, another method to find new water hopefully catch some fish of course most importantly make sure you bring your fishing poles keep them in your car at all times you never know when you might need to fish all right so Turn on the nav, U-map. Obviously, this only works in uh, newer cars. Maybe you got a little excitement here, police officer. Whoa, 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 whoa! The guy just almost backed up into me. I don't know what that cop's doing, he's going up there. Anyway. Back this out a little bit. Zoom out. That helps too. We'll see something over here. We'll see something up here. I can kind of see the roads to get to it too. This is the river here. That's the river. All right, let's check uh, let's check out that one there on Lakeside Drive. Looks like it might have potential. All right, see, it? looks like potential. There it is there on the map again. All right, now we look for uh, no fishing signs. Hopefully, I don't see any of those. I don't see any no fishing signs. That looks like it's got lots of potential. I don't see any no fishing signs. That's always great. I don't want to trespass. Let's see what we got here. People certainly fish here. It's a nice pond.
keep my distance if I get too close. Spook them. Another nice bass. You didn't hit that one very hard. Ooh, got some fight left in him. All right, switch to a ultra minnow number four crankbait. See what we get with this. Oh, missed him. <laughs> I pulled him right out of the water just a little. All right, let's try that again. That bird, he's got a, a hawk's got a fish. I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> That's awesome. Got a little one. Real little one. <laughs> yeah, that's a little one. Missed them. Oh, you guys see that? A little otter coming. <laughs> well, he's not scared of me, is he? <laughs> Oh, right by the shore there. Yeah. Nice one. Ah, that's a nice bass. Barely had him hooked. Yeah, nice one. Okay, trying a different spot. It's a nice little pond, I like it. Hard to fish the other side though. That one. Yeah. Nice one. Oh, dang it. Didn't set the hook in though. Darn it. That was a good bass. 
Got to set the hook, ladies and gentlemen. Got to set the hook. So I was using this. Jig. It's got this shaker on here. It couldn't really fit the body, so I just stuck it on there the best I could. I don't have a lot of experience fishing a jig, honestly. Alright, thanks for watching. Make sure you click subscribe. Uh, comment below. Uh, let me know if you guys ever use your nav to uh, find new places to fish. Uh, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. Keep those lines wet. Have a great day.